but here I am I'm drinking Hello Lisha Deluxe or what not back again with another video so I'm actually glad to make this video why am I I saw this uh, topic um, at Lydia Dingas uh, YouTube channel I will link her video down below and she was actually talking about insecurities and one of her biggest insecurities and the thing that she was talking about is something that I was very much insecure when I was younger um, but by getting older I wasn't really ashamed or insecure about my big forehead I like me some Bonzu. Oh hi. All right, cool. So get comfortable because we're gonna talk about one of my biggest insecurities and <laughs> stretch marks. I actually wanted to ask y'all because I got my stretch marks when I got skinnier. Um, I lost a lot of weight in a short a short period of time. Uh, I went from a size thirty eight, so it was back in the days. <laughs> Um, I went from a size 38 uh, to a size 34 in three or four weeks and it was due to my birth control and um, I lost so much weight that I saw some search marks on my bottom and I was like why am I getting stretch marks when I'm losing weight. So for those who I actually want to ask y'all if you actually got stretch marks and if you do, did you get it when you got when you gained weight or when you lost weight? Because I my first stretch marks was because I lost weight. Very bizarre, but it is what it is. And the first stretch mark that I got was on my bottom. And that's something that I was really insecure about because first of all, I can't swim. So that turned out okay because uh, I don't, re I didn't really had to go with um, my classmates to go swim because I was, besides me not knowing how to swim, I was really secure about showing my ass off, public eye, uh, having those stretch marks. So I tried to avoid any kind of circumstances where. Um, you're gonna see like my bottom and basically also my stretch marks. But you know, you get older and I started to gain weight and that's where I became more insecure, not about my weight, but for my stretch marks, I'm like a little bit the sides. So it went from my ass to the sides and I was like, oh my gosh, I don't want this because they were dark. They were, oh my gosh, they were like black, like jet black, no, I'm not overreacting, but they were shit black and that's where I didn't really want to change when I wanted to go to the gym where uh, people basically, it frustrates me that women see another woman with stretch marks and they be like, ugh. And in the beginning, in, in the beginning, <laughs> uh, I was really sad about that. Like, I'm not usually that quick sad, like I cry a lot. It's certainly when I'm like Netflix and cry because I don't Netflix and chill anymore. I always put on some drama, movie or anything and then somebody dies and then I need to cry and shit. So in the beginning I was really sad uh, about my stretch marks. Then I became mad. Like whenever I saw like somebody get like look at me crazy in the gym, uh, whether it's at school or like really basic fit things, I'll be verbally aggressive like um, what the fuck are you looking at? Is there something wrong? What the fuck? What? What? Is there something bothering you with my body? Like what? And um, knowing that um, they are looking at my stretch marks, it makes me kind. Of, it made me kind of pissed. Like I didn't ask for it. Like I understand. Like stretch marks are not your cup of tea. Like they cannot be everybody's cup of tea. But there are people out there that don't mind having a woman with stretch marks, having a man with stretch marks, because men also get stretch marks. So I can understand that it's not your cup of tea. Like, short men are not my cup of tea. Like, I, I personally would not date a man that's shorter than me. But that's not my cup of tea. But I don't judge people who 
fall in love with other men. I couldn't prevent those stretch marks because I didn't know better. Like I lost weight, I gained weight. And there are like remedies to avoid stretch marks, but like I can't, I couldn't have prevented it. So for me, it's like, basically if it's not your cup of tea or your glass of wine, eh? <laughs> Don't drink it, don't spill it, because some of you men and women, let me say this, I call you rachachas, okay? If it's not your cup of tea, leave it alone, because if you, okay, you don't want to drink it, I understand, but don't spill it neither. I don't know if I'm, I'm, I'm making sense, um, I hope I'm, I am, because in my head I am, I talk negative about it, and other people that didn't even mind now are looking at it like you are and that's not okay like i don't think that's okay and i don't agree with that shit. and i want to tell you so bad that i don't care about what y'all think about what y'all say about my stretch marks but it's harder because um it used to be black like really jet black like i said and then it got lighter like really brown light and then now that i've gained a lot of weight again the last year i'm getting um those darker stretch marks and yes i do mind yes i don't like it and but i don't ask for it but basically i yes i can't stop gaining weight but not everybody that gains weight or that is a little bit thick okay like i am or just a little bit bigger um got stretch marks so yeah i hope to find something and i'm really searching something for that i'm really searching for something that will make sure that my stretch marks get a little bit lighter uh, definitely for beginning of the summer so i will be trying some products out and if those products work and y'all are insecure about those dark um stretch marks then make sure to subscribe to my channel so i will talk about some products that i will be using for two months because i think some results are based on time and effort so i will be starting in february with one product and then in april if it turned out great then i will show you guys but if you're not subscribed how will you know i really encourage you to embrace it but i want to be true to myself and true to you guys i'm not at that point yet so when i will i hope when you think you are then comment down below something to make me feel a little bit better and not feel really alone with this insecurity and but honestly some people just need a little bit like if somebody talks bad about you or something that you're really insecure about just pop that vest okay just i hope that you have enjoyed this video and like i said comment down below to see in one of my next videos luxuries bye bye cut shit why did I start drinking before I started this video, huh? I beg. <laughs>